So the internet is ablaze. People are upset about this lady who apparently requires you to pay up if you want to date her. Now, if you behave, she gives you the money back. If you do not, she takes it away. I really like this thumbnail. It's almost like, give me, give me the cash. Give me the cash. Is it a thumbnail that she did just for this particular uh, newspaper? Or do you think uh, this is her dating profile? Look at this. $2,500. You know what's that? That's how much her time is worth, chat. That, that is how much she considers her personal time is worth. Now, apparently, the reason she started doing this is going to be difficult for you as a man to understand and relate, but it happens to women. Uh, people ghosted her. And because people ghosted her, she went like, well, my time is important. I, I can't stand this no more. And then she started asking people for a $50 deposit. And since people paid, uh, she started asking for more. Which uh, is obviously understandable. We live in a very strong capitalist society, so why shouldn't she? Everything is worth what uh, the purchaser would pay for at the end of the day. Uh, she also considers uh, other misbehaviors, uh, such as having multiple sexual partners, such as uh, being married. There were a couple of men being married. Uh, one of them apparently said, yes, yes, I'm married, but uh, tomorrow the divorce is settled. And uh, that type of activity, which uh, displeased her, and uh, she then would uh, ask for a deposit if a second date were to occur. Now, uh, people are very upset, obviously, and I don't understand why. Uh, first of all, if you don't want to get in such a situation, uh, what are you doing on a dating site? Are you loco? This goes for both men and women, by the way. Uh, why are you using dating sites? It's the most dehumanizing app known to man. I mean, you're looking at other human beings as if they're products on a supermarket. Uh, stop it. Get, get off dating apps. If you want to find a significant other uh, and you don't have the confidence of meeting people in real life, at least for the love of God, use Facebook. Facebook is a very good app to which uh, you can get to know other people. First of all, it doesn't have the same vibe where you're on a dating app and people know why they're there and they probably went through a hundred other partners before. And if they're with you, they can go, well, the moment something bad happens, I can just find 10 other people with the app. Uh, and on Facebook, you can also see the likes of the person, like the genuine likes. You can see what music they enjoy. You can see what uh, movies they, they like. You can see if they share hobbies with you. And it's a lot more easy to start the conversation that way so uh, you can hit up the uh, crush you had on your high school years ago. You can hit up uh, girls from your university. You can uh, look at people. Don't, don't look at people at work, by the way. That's an HR meeting in the making. Uh, but you can join uh, various clubs that you may like. So, for example, an anime group or a, a geek club or whatever. And you can find people there. Right, like that's a lot better. Like if you if you have to go on the internet to meet people, just just do Facebook, okay, or anything else. Just just don't do dating apps. Really bad idea. Uh, I mean, even even in this article, it keeps talking about this lady as if it's an ongoing thing, as if it's a business model. Like like they they don't talk about how she wants to settle down. It seems like she's going to keep doing this, and she keeps talking guys plural. Like, how many are we talking about? Because it seems that if you're reaching the level 2,500, you've been seeing quite a few guys. And the question is, you know, uh, even men have this problem. If, if you're a womanizer, if you're going to date a lot of women, eventually it's going to be very difficult, if not impossible, to fall in love. I mean, there is a negative feedback to serotonin after a while. So it is not a good thing. It's not a good lifestyle. I would not recommend it. Um, so yes, do not use dating uh, websites, uh, they're really bad. Uh, instead, uh, try something else. Obviously, the best thing to do is to meet people in real life, but uh, that may also be a lawsuit in the making. So just uh, stick to Facebook. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you in the comment section. Take care.